We've got a year's worth of sports wishes come true for children faced with life-threatening illness on this holiday edition of My Wish. Her love of gymnastics gave her grace and athleticism. A chronic disease took it all away. Undaunted, she got back on the floor for a wish that put her face to face with an Olympic gold medal winner and that filled her with support and self-confidence. You could do a cartwheel on the balance wheel. Yeah. That sounds really hard. It is. Here in San Antonio, Texas, 13-year-old Amarissa Mauricio can still remember how gymnastics made her feel. I, it was really energizing and cool, like, just to know that you can do some of the stuff other people on TV do. It's really cool. Who would you watch on TV doing some of that stuff? Gary Douglas. I liked how she practiced like all of her life and then went to the Olympics at such a young age and won it. In the spring of 2013, the family was living in Puerto Rico when Amarissa began to feel increasingly weak and listless. I called the clinic and I said, there's something wrong with her. She can't walk. She's pulling herself up into bed. You feel like in, in your soul that something's wrong. Amarissa and her family were told that she had lupus, a chronic autoimmune disorder that attacks vital organs, a potentially fatal disease. In the hospital, her condition continued to deteriorate. Her liver was failing. Her heart was enlarged. She was dying, and she knew it. She broke down, and she cried, and she said, I can't do this anymore. She said, I don't want to be sick. And so I pressed her. What do you want to do? And I was expecting her to say die. But being the person that she is, she looked at me and she said, I don't want to die. And I told her, you have to fight. You have to fight. What did you have to do to be a fighter? Think I'm going to get out of this and I'm going to be okay. And then actually start to believe it. She had chemotherapy. Steroids ballooned her weight. And she was told to discontinue gymnastics. They said no major impact to your organs. And she rolled over in her bed and she cried. I kind of felt like I was losing a part of myself. There's no cure for lupus, but for now, the 14 pills she takes each day are controlling her immune system. Doctors have cleared her for limited gymnastics. Get your balance. Very nice. Coupe and step forward. Her wish is to spend a day with Gabby Douglas and recapture the pride and grace she once felt. When Amarissa is told there's a special message for her on this cell phone, she doesn't know what to think. Hold your phone. Hi, Marissa. It's Gabby Douglas. <laughs> I think you're a big fan of gymnastics. You have a very special wish. So I'm going to invite you and your family here to Iowa. Looking forward to meeting you. See you soon. Days later, Amarissa is in Iowa, where Gabby's been training. I'm so <laughs> It's so nice to meet you. I thought we could be twins. We're 20, right? Yeah. That's awesome. You want to match with me? Yeah. Let's do it. 
You look so good in that, Leo. <laughs> Thanks. You it looks too. so good on you. <laughs> I got you. I've never done this before. Now, as they warm up on the low beam, Gabby takes on Marissa's hands. Oh, someone's never done that before. You did good. Oh. <laughs> With Gabby offering steady encouragement. Do you want to try one? You want to give it a shot? Turns out Amarissa's got a few skills of her own. Good job! High five! That was really good. Amarissa knows just how challenging some of Gabby's moves are. To see them executed up close leaves her in a state of amazement. <laughs> Whoa. Is it okay if I, like, tape you up and, like... Yeah. Okay. This is what I do. Feel good? Yeah. You want to know something about those grips? What? Those are my Olympic grips. Oh my god. <laughs> Mom. Like that. Yeah. And they keep going together. Got me showing Amarissa all her moves. Gabby even teaches Amarissa part of her floor exercise from the Olympics. Like wax on, and then like wax on, and like flip it. Now, the girl who'd lost what helped make her feel special is finding it again. Finish. Yay! You're so good at that. And this Olympic champion has brought something she'd like to share. I'm Marissa gets Gabby out of the gym for a little girl time. Okay. Let me do it? Yeah, okay. How'd that look? It looks just like a leaf. Yes! Yes! Should I make a hard nose? Yeah, you should make a hard nose. Should I? You get goofy. I'll do it just for you. Aww. That's <laughs> cute. Once again, their partnership creates something special, giving Amarissa just the sort of upbeat attitude that'll keep her strong and positive and feeling like a champion. Amarissa and her family have moved to Arizona, where she hopes to join her school's dance team next fall. In October, she joined Julian Lennon, global ambassador for the Lupus Foundation, to light the Empire State Building in New York City. She also gave a brief speech at the Foundation's annual dinner and received a standing ovation.